So just to show you real quick what I did with my GoPro on my ski bag, I wanted to put this little video. This is a ski bag I took to Japan, and you can see right here how I took an old GoPro housing, uh, and I removed the lens cover from it, put it on the outside, and then put the screws through with the fabric and hid the GoPro inside. On the inside of the bag, you can see that there's this zipper compartment that I pulled back, and then there's a hard cover, and then some foam that I cut through to put the GoPro behind it, and then put the lens through there. And so you can see it's actually a pretty sturdy mounting option that kept it in place. The one thing I didn't think about is how closely I put it to this handle because whenever I was carrying it around, the handle kind of dragged in front of the lens. And that was the same case for people that were, uh, for what other baggage handlers were, as it was going from uh, where I started to Japan for this. Unfortunately, because it was such an old GoPro, the, the image quality is very high. And I put it on a time lapse to try to save the battery and just take still pictures of it at a five second interval rather than do a video. Uh, but still, by the time I got to Japan, the, the batteries were long gone, again, because of things so old. But that's just another method that I used to do something similar to what Seth did.